so it looks like um, if you know about golden girls right uh, this is one of my favorite favorite um, uh, TV serial that I used to watch a lot so what happened is on July 8 his son he reported that uh, his father was missing um, and what happened is uh, Charles Levine he, when he was missing he was actually uh, born in Michigan okay in uh, 1949 I believe so when uh, he did not return his phones and uh, his pets were with him but you know this his son was like thinking what is he like uh, you know I, he's not answering and things like that so he then called the uh, you know the the police and he mentioned to them that he is missing his father is missing Charles Levine and obviously um, Charles Levine was involved in the in the film industry uh, since uh, 1975 until 1998 so she he has been uh, with the film industry uh, for a long time 1975 to 1998 almost like um, uh, 30 23 years something like that so that's a long time and he obviously we know that he uh, participated in uh, many famous TV serials and, and and movies and things like that for example uh, he uh, took part he appeared in television series like uh, uh, Seinfeld and LA Law obviously uh, we also know from the news is that he was 70 years old um, so you know things happen uh, like this and uh, whatever uh, we do no matter what you know how we live our life uh, unfortunately a lot of things happen that we don't want to happen on Friday uh, an emergency call, cell phone it pinged the um, uh, it pinged uh, the phone I believe uh, that Charles Levin was using so obviously when something pings uh, the authorities can be alerted and they can find the location so that this is exactly what happened with him that his cell phone ping uh, and that led the authorities to, to search a remote area northwest of Selma okay northwest of Selma the grants past Department of uh, Public Safety said uh, that's what they mentioned but there was no sign of uh, of Levine now this is very interesting to me because if you know he was there if in, indeed he was he went there for whatever reason and then all of a sudden he gets missing and now he they cannot find his body like I mean to me it sounds very strange very strange indeed uh, if you are looking for a body and uh, you come across I mean how is that even possible like say maybe okay July 8th today is uh, only f only a few few days ago like you know uh, a week ago he go, he went missing so I I have no idea after reading the story I find it very very um, very interesting and and uh, I mean I'm 100% not I cannot be 100% sure exactly what happened obviously they're doing their own things the authorities um, so a resident in that area they found Levin's car on Saturday on a remote uh, almost impossible road okay so looks like he stepped out of the car he was going somewhere or maybe the car broke down something happened um, and he died of that you know overwhelming kind of like a if you're got if you're stuck in the middle of a road and middle of nowhere and you are 70 years old in this case he was 70 years old I mean I don't know but um, you may get you know sick physically uh, you may lose it and you know end up having to face uh, some severe consequences for that uh, Levin's pug Pooh Bear uh, was found in the vehicle Levin's body was located near the car and this is what the police has mentioned uh, based on the circumstances there is a high probability that the remains are those of Levin, uh, Charles Levine's and obviously the medical examiner will make the final identification of the remains police said Levine appeared in, uh, in one episode of Seinfeld in one episode as I mentioned he also appeared in uh, uh, Golden Girls uh, and, uh, in, uh, and Seinfeld was in 1993 uh, he also appeared on shows such as Elise, NYPD Blue and Hill Street Blues according to IMDB website if you go to that website you'll be able to find more uh, Levin also had roles in films so as I said he took part in films in movies uh, The Golden Child 
Uh, these things again is very interesting because uh, to me it doesn't add up. Okay, there is something I don't know. Um, so he he um, he was born in March of nineteen March twelfth, nineteen forty nine, and um, he died on July eight. So he was around. He lived uh, quite a long time, seven years. Uh, was an American actor who appeared in television, movies, and on stage. He was the best known for the role uh, Elliot Novak on the series Alice, having become a regular in the show's ninth season and the recurring role of um, Eddie Gregg on Hill Street Blues from 1982 to 1986. Uh, we'll talk about his uh, life and career a little bit. And uh, he was also known for having played uh, the Mohel on the uh, on the breeze episode of Seinfeld and Coco uh, they go in the gay cook on the on the pilot episode the golden girls <laughs> the pilot episode on the golden girls so if you um, know the golden girls uh, episode if you know the series the the TV show uh, I mean uh, they this this uh, ladies were very funny his part was dropped in favor of making the character of Sofia Petrillo if you know Sofia Petrillo I'll put a face right here uh, Sofia Petrillo and she was the one I believe she was Italian something like that played by uh, Esteli uh, Getty a regular uh, and then he appeared as a guest a star on many television shows including Family Ties um, Tales from the Dark Side, The Twilight Zone, The Facts of Life, Falcon, Crest, Punky, uh, Brewster, and Off Officer Bob, 30-something, uh, Night Court, L.A. Law, as Robert um, Caprore, uh, Designing Woman, Murphy Brown, NYPD Blue, and Law and Order. Okay, so Law and Order, if you know that one, uh, is, pr is a very popular TV serial, Law and Order. Okay, if you don't know what I'm talking about, Law and Order is something very, um, very famous. Uh, and even uh, where I'm from, originally back home uh, in Asia, um, people watch Law and Order, uh, that serial. I used to watch, I mean, not all the time, but sometimes uh, and for the purpose of learning English and things like that. So it is it's a good thing. Sometimes uh, you learn from other people, uh, good things you learn from other people. And so he uh, his disappearance and 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 uh, his he disappeared as, as i said july 8 uh, 2019 which is a few days ago uh, and as we know levin son reported to the police that charles levin had been missing for several days levin's car was found uh, on july 12th and july 14th human remains were found nearby so he was not in his car he was outside his car i mean crazy right just crazy which uh, grants past uh, Department of uh, Public Safety described as having a, a, a high probability of being Levine's so um, again this is a very sad news indeed for many people especially for his family not gonna be easy to deal with but I know when I saw the, the main reason I want to make this video is was when I saw his his picture and when I actually came to know that he was actually working with the Golden Girls I'm like you know that piqued my interest uh, in him and 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 I just thought about it I'm like okay so I should because sometimes I, I do think that I remember this uh, person I, I remember his face uh, in that Golden Girls episode in the in the, in the series uh, with the other other um, ladies and um, Sophia Petrillo if you know what I'm talking about again so uh, when I saw this picture, I'm like, I need to find out more about him. But uh, I mean, just ima imagine yourself being in the, you know, going somewhere, getting lost with your pets in the middle of the road and you get out of the road and then something happens to you. You are not able to contact anybody. You're not able to get in touch with anybody. And then, you know, people find you remaining. So that is pretty you know uh, strange because the the way people i mean if you find a remain like my my thing is that if you find a remain of of a human you should have the face right you and, and it's not even like too too long ago only a few days ago so what happened to the face 
okay so these are some of the things that i find very strange uh, very very interesting as the news is unfolding um, i hope that you can get some information from this video you can share this video uh, leave your opinion let me know what you think about this whole saga um, his death and what you think he as of him as, as an individual as a person as an actor uh, his role in the golden girls the one I, I i watched a lot and um, yeah subscribe to this channel and i will see you next time